Welcome back everybody, Twitch367 here, and today we're going to continue with episode 25 of our Elder Scrolls Online series here on the channel. Once again, if you guys want to interact with me or any of the other members of the Discord, take a peek at the Discord link down in the description. While you're down there, take a peek at all the other social media links, including the 10% off W link. Helps me out, helps out the company, and just a great thing to do. That being said, we always kind of start with uh, our characters over here and kind of where they're at. Um, so Rough Bog, the character that we always play, um, Rosemary, still level 11 with Brutus, uh, Silver Rune of Thorn, Mala of Fang, and Lord Twitch. Honestly, I don't think any of them have changed. Uh, he probably just has a bunch more in his inventory because he's the lowest level. Uh, oh, I guess I should go to Raynor. He'll be used very, very soon. So, let's go ahead and hop right in with Rough Bog. Some people don't like the bustle of cities, but I come from a big family, so it reminds me of home. All right, so that's right. We needed to catch the rats. Oh, they're so small. I was expecting bigger. Did you hear about the circ? There is no cure. I knew it. All right, now drop the rats off at the door. Now we talk to the sergeant. Looks like the rats are moving in. I appreciate your help in this. Now no one will get hurt. Those people just want to see their friends and families again. But I don't want them to get hurt. Calling the guards will just make the situation worse. I got the information from my contact in the group. Report back to the kin house. I'll meet you there. I'm going to retrieve a key that you'll need. And keep this quiet, alright? All right. There's something going on over there. There was something going on over there. Any sign of Giron? Or Ralden? That's good news. I also heard from my associate, Nariu Virian. We may have finally gotten a few breaks in this sordid situation. Nariu told me you found a note at the Moorborn camp. That might be a link to the creator of the Lodos Plague. This drastically changes our stance on the situation here. I care only about a name and a location. Such information brings me closer to fulfilling my current contract. Because of this, I've decided to offer some assistance. I'll gather the House Halalu guards and follow you. Whatever you find, the guard will be there to back you up. Now go. Find your ally and save the counselor. I'll catch up with you soon. I'll gather the guards and follow in your path. Now go. Find your ally and let's finish this. I've been here for weeks. Playing the political games common to all Dark Elf kin houses. I've decided I hate such games. 
But you'd be surprised what you can learn if you just stand back and listen. Giron isn't our target. We're after the one who created the Lodos Plague. I decided to reach out to you and provide a modicum of aid. Your actions may lead me to the one I seek. Right now, I'm your very best friend. Work with me, and we'll make sure Narcissus isn't destroyed by the Maulborn. Well, they're certainly not the altruistic organization they pretend to be. It's definitely a militaristic cult, but who controls them is still unclear. I'm sure they're connected to this box mentioned in the notes you discovered. No idea. We're still working on that. Okay, so... At the Go Find Our Ally... Which just happens to be right here. I've got the key and the location you seek, as promised. Our plan might have worked a little too well. We can still hear ruins beneath Narcissus. You can find the entrance to the west. Old door. Looks out of place against the rocks. Doors locked to keep people out of the ruins. Guess that didn't work out. Don't thank me. You're the one rushing into the fire. I should be thanking you. Just be careful down there. If what Marja said is true, you're going to run into a lot of opposition. Worthless, a lot of them. It looks like the entrance is pretty close to the uh, portal here, or the. Way shrine, rather. I'm going to try to take out as many people as possible just because that's experience and plus they do drop gold and they're useful weapons. And glyphs. Glyphs are always nice too. Never used to fight this much until I met you. Well, that was pretty quick. Maybe I should have joined the boy and armagers.
Okay, above. Didn't see the staircase. It was pretty dark. Help me, please. Giron betrayed me. He killed our people and put Lotus Plague into their bodies. Said it made it more potent. He needed a large supply of potential corpses. That's why he wanted Narsis locked down. It's too late for me, but you must listen. Don't let anyone drink the water. The lake must be cleansed. And I need to tell you about Vox. She's their leader. Narsis is only the beginning. They're making Lotus Plague in the gorge. They're going to spread it to... to... more... There you are. Good to see you. Still alive, I see. I suppose that justifies Naryu's confidence in you. Did you find them? How's Ralden? Are they inside? I see. Ralden was a good man who cared for his people. He should be remembered that way. The guards are dealing with a moorborn in the ruins. What happened in there? So that's why he wanted Narsis locked down. He wanted a ready supply of plague carriers. House Tlalu will make sure no one drinks from the lake until it's cleansed. Narsis is safe, at least for now. We'll get these so people weird. to the healers. You should get some rest. I fear things are about to get more complicated. The Moorborn are more dangerous than we thought. I'm sure your help will be needed again. We'll make sure these people receive care. When you have a moment, return to Narsis and speak to Naryu. She has a lead on the name you uncovered. I'll join you as soon as I can. Yes, I had Naryu investigate the evidence you retrieved from the Moorborn camp. She discovered something she wants to share. Find her back in town. Another hide helmet. Man, I'm just really lucking out on like actual gear for rough bog, aren't I? I swear, I can't seem to finish a job without you showing up to complicate matters. Oh, just give me a moment, would you? I'm right in the middle of something here. The documents you found in the Moorborn camp contained several names. A few appeared over and over. After a little bit of digging, I connected one of them to our target. Because I also learned that Tlalu troops had been ambushed by superior Moorborn forces at the Obsidian Gorge. Our target leads those forces. We want the Arcanist. Saving Tlalu troops isn't part of our mandate. But maybe together... Now you've got it. Baron and I will join you shortly. We need to send our report and wait for our next orders. Stay safe. I'll see you soon, my friend. Okay, so tracking the plague is the next quest. To the Obsidian Gorge, where it's just right past the Way Shrine. And of course, more hide stuff. In a big family, you have to know how to scrap.
Alright, there's the captain. No one goes into the gorge. Got that? Do we say why the pass is closed? Tell them there's death in the pass. Leave it at that. Yes, yes commander. commander. Speak to Captain D. Will if you need something. About damn time we got some help out here. We're outmatched. Captain Deerill will give you a little more insight into what's happening here. If you're planning to use the pass to Mournhold, find another route. It's not safe. The Moorborn have overrun the trader's camp and occupied the pass. By the authority of House Halalu, this area is closed. It's a death trap. We sent in some scouts to assess the situation, but they haven't returned. I don't want to march in there blindly, but we can't wait much longer. This pass is too important to allow it to fall into the Moorborn's hands. It's the primary trading route between Mornhold and the West. It's also home to a trader's camp. Every caravan that comes through this part of Dushan depends on that camp. That's an excellent question. Harassing caravan seems to go against their usual method of operations, doesn't it? a bit of a warm-up. We need to report back. Morborn. They're trying to make the plague stronger. The alchemist who created the Lotus Plague. Magendry. He's making it stronger. More potent. Ooh, a stronger plague? Morbon plan to smuggle it into Mournhold. Infect the whole city. There's no time. You need to stop them. The Morborn can't bring cargo through the city gates without official papers. They're carrying forged shipping manifests. Maybe it's worth a try. Take out some of the Morborn down in the trader's camp. Get those forged papers. Just a bunch of food. There's a lore book here at least. Swords. I mean, I should look in the sacks too, just in case there's any corrupting motives. Go back up here. The manifests. Did you get them? Good. This should buy us enough time to act. But question. Before we strike back, we need to gather our swords. I wish I knew how many of the others survived. I think most of them were captured. I saw some of them dragged off toward that cave to the north. I'll report to Dewell and let him know what's happening here. You go to the cave. Alright, to the north.
grab all of that gold and knock out the last one. And more gold. Those Nyx hounds won't take me. Won't make me into a husk. Bled myself with my own blade. No use to them now. That'll show them. I... What was I saying? Did Scout Marmin send you? I was glad she got away. The others, they're all gone. Medium armor. I've seen what the plague does to a body. I won't let it take me. But if the wards were destroyed... Arcane wardstones that make the Moorborn immune to the plague. A gift from someone called Vox. Sure would be a shame if those Aelids came down with their own plague. How about we smash those wards that are protecting them? I heard them crying out in the darkness. The plague's taken them. They've turned the wards. Concentrate on the wards. There are three of them. Smash them all. Those wards keep the Moorborn from getting infected by their plague. Smash them down into the all right. Claim our rewards. Ooh, 30. I'll get a flame astronaut crate. All right, let's see. Let's put this one to stamina. Fiery chain. Okay, I only get one, so I need to. Really. I think I'm just gonna go passive for now do a little bit more damage Let's start with the first one. All right, I got an orcish battle axe. Should be part of that. 
Get rid of these plague stalkers. Alright, one more ward. Destroy the final one. Armor heavy. Perfect. Technically, this is supposed to be a new gear episode, isn't it? You're still alive. Scout Marmine told us she sent you to this cave. Veron says he knows you from Narsis. He and his ally have offered their assistance. We have to proceed cautiously. I don't want any more of my soldiers getting infected. But the Moleborn have to be dealt with for good. Ah, that changes things. We've spotted the plague shipment they planned for Mournhold. I want those crates destroyed, but I need my troops at a safe distance when it happens. Always. A cliff overlooks their loaded wagons, and I've got archers up there. Get to Nari Uberian. Tell her to have the archers shatter the crates from above. We'll see how the Moleborn like being exposed to their own plague. Good idea. Exactly what we need. On your way, then. That tunnel will take... Alright, so... I think we're gonna switch it to just every 10th episode we're gonna get new armor. Alright, so I'll hold off over here. Take on these swarming wasps. Okay, that's well, a cooler battle axe. Maybe they should try that. Oh man. Alright, well that is all the time we have for this episode. So if you guys did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe if you have not already. Next episode we're going to go ahead and defend the archers up here and just kind of continue. Um, inventory is looking pretty empty still, so we're, we're looking good there. Uh, but with that, I hope you guys have a great day. I will see you in the next episode. See ya.